What is up guys, Going of One here, and uh, yes, we're still playing some more Warface, although you should know that because you kind of click clicked on this, yes, I know. For some reason I can't exactly talk straight banana today because, you know, Blitz, what the hell. Alright, so, uh, Team Deathmatch, let's go with that, because last time I played this, quite a while back, um, it was awesome. It was awesome, it was just, it, it, it went, it was just a complete war. You can literally say it was a proper war, which is good because, you know, it's meant to be like that. Okay, wow, headshot, headshot. Alright, just give you, what the hell? Okay, that, that kind of lagged there, but, alright, it's because I'm entering game. Just give you all guys a heads up, I am terrible beyond belief with a mouse, as you can see right now. I don't know what's going on. Alright, that's, I'm surprised the PC kept up with that, my PC's a piece of shit. Alright, anyway, so, uh, yeah, terrible with the uh, mouse and keyboard, I usually work with, uh, Xbox controller, or PlayStation controller, mainly Xbox, so yeah. Okay, so, I guess that's it. Oh yeah, this is probably the first episode of Team Deathmatch. And I haven't played this game in a little while, except for that, um, Battle Royale thing I just recorded a little while ago. Yep. That's right, I recorded two videos in one day. Amazing, isn't it? Actually, I record a few, it's just a matter that I can't post them all. Alright, so, uh, starting game, please. I love how they just randomly give me guns so I can shoot around the place. Whoa. Alright, Golden Shield. Oh, look, by the way, I ranked up, yay, from the last video at the... Um, Battle Royale, that's right, I, I didn't forget, that's right. Alright, so hopefully, wow, that's pretty cool. Can I also put those things in the back? Oh, that guy has no name. See all this? That use you dash, lots of numbers? I actually thought, whoa, that guy's a high level and he hasn't even made his own name. I thought those are AI. In the beginning of the game, I was like, whoa, these freaking AI, they move like humans, they move like actual players and stuff. I'm like, whoa, it's amazing. Warface has the like smartest AI, and then I was like, "Oh wait, look at my name!" All right, they're not AI; they're just people that haven't changed their name yet. I changed mine, so yeah. But that that whole gameplay that I thought they were AI, I was just amazed beyond belief. You should have seen my face was like, "Whoa, what the hell!" Yeah, it must suck being the last one to load in. Uh, can we go to war, please? Oh, I don't want to be the Blackwood team. I want to be the Warface team. I mean, look at it. Look at that symbol. That's cooler. Screw you guys. Let's go. Do we have any medics? Alright. Open field. Uh, can I climb this? Can I? No, I cannot. Okay, I can't. Son of a... Alright. Screw it. Whatever. I'd prefer to go uh, get as close as possible to things to work off of. Due to the fact that I'm using a... Okay, well, I'm lagging a little bit. I'm using a uh, fully automatic, uh, which doesn't help me in close quarters with shotgunners. At all. So yeah, I'll just give you guys a heads up there. Alright, I don't think I can call for a medic, so I will not even try. Someone's down, someone's down, someone's down. I'm on my way. Alright, he, he helped him. Am I under attack? No, I'm not. Close quarters, you usually want to use... Oh, Claymore, bitches! Okay, usually in close quarters you want to use shotguns because, you know, close quarters, and if you didn't know that, you're stupid. Yeah. Shotguns are awesome because they get an area spread. Well, that's usually how shotguns work. You do get the modified ones that don't do an area spread, which, to be honest, is a little bit weird to me. Considering that when I've, I've been raised... Oh, shit, well done! Nice! That was awesome. I could have saved my teammate, but, you know, what the hell. You might want to watch out, sniper dude. Okay, I got no kills. Do I? No, wait, I got one kill. Yay, one kill! Usually I reload after every kill, but, uh, not this time, apparently. Alright, uh, teammates nearby, which means I can. Okay, let me just quickly try to find out where I put where my snipers are. Alright, I have no snipers up right now. Okay, I will be saying a lot that I do, wording it out, because... For YouTube, you have to try to talk 100% of the time, and he killed me. Okay. For YouTube, you have to talk at least 100% of the time, which makes it, uh, so you don't have to edit out as much as possible. Yeah. The more, less you talk, the more you edit, the more you talk, the less you edit. That's how it works, because I spend eight hours editing sometimes, and no one's going to help him. I wish I was there. In fact, where is he? He can use some assistance. Here we are, buddy. I am no call. Okay, I'm not even going to say that name, because I will be slaughtered. Oh, what? I shot you! 
Thank you, medic, for trying to help me, but that will not exactly work. Uh, dude, please don't leave me. Hello, is it me you're looking for? Oh, sweet, this guy's awesome. Bro, thank you. Oh, okay, cool. Okay, yeah. They're coming up. Alright. Oh, headshot. Alright, so this is our main sniping area, which means uh, we spawn here as well, which would push the enemy back quite a little bit, but it also means that we have a view over the entire battlefield, which gives us the advantage. So other actual players, uh, other actual like battlefield players especially, they'll try rush us to get rid of their main salt, their main line of defense. The main line of defense is usually snipers because it gives them the height advantage and the long range advantage, which is kind of basic stuff. Where are you? Come on, step out. Come on. I know you're behind there. Sometimes you have to give a warning shot on the opposite window, which shows that you're providing cover fire in a certain location, allowing them to push out towards another area. That helps a lot in uh, we weeding tax tactics. W e e d i n g. Do not get the wrong idea. Yeah. Uh, shoot that bottle. Nice. All right. So as you see, it's suppressed fire. That guy's gonna be down for a little bit, which means I can look off the sides. And my teammate is down. Fuck you. All right. Considering I'm the last one left. You're down. You can use some help. This does help because now... Is this guy a medic? Yep, he's a medic. That that's that actually helps a lot more. Which is very clever, by the way, guys. That's a banana peel. I know. Okay, um... Grenade. grenade. Nice. Wait, I also have a grenade. Oh, yeah. Just push out a little bit. Oh, just got him. Okay, he's gonna help him up. That's that is okay. While he does that, I'll provide some cover fire so at least one of them can get up. Cover fire is not needed. I have not seen any signs of someone approaching the windows. Okay. Okay. Considering someone's died there, we have. That entrance. Alright, teammate's gone in there, which means he must sort him out. Okay, so... We're all busy. What's happening now, guys, is most of you have actually noticed. We are... Hold on. What has happened now is we're just busy... Hold The snipers will hold back the enemies, especially enemy snipers, which gives us the advantage due to the fact that we now own the battlefield in long range and, and short range, considering that now we've pushed them back to the point that... Okay, hold on. Come on, show your face. Show your face. Show your face. Oh, huh, okay. Alright. So now that we push them back, uh, it allows my teammates to get a little bit closer, which gives them more cover. As you can see, their side has a little bit more cover than our side does. Where you go? Alright, teammate down. Let's make this quick. Someone's on his way. Get up, get up, get up, get up. At least you have to live. Alright. Alright, as you see the enemies are mainly nearby their base until you get the one that does nice pistol, wow. You do get the one that does rush it quite a bit, which does not exactly help us much, but it is also a clever tactic. Oh, okay, um, <laughs> I, I was gonna help him, but... Yeah. Guys, <laughs> please don't leave me. Okay, I got a sniper, which this is not a clever tactic, uh, running in with a sniper rifle. Especially considering that I suck with a mouse. But, you know, whatever. The, everyone has is now aware of that as our location for our sniper uh, sniping. So that gives us, that puts us in a disadvantage considering a sniper rifle should at least give off one magazine before relocating. Okay, as you see there, the killer killed me. Killer, wait, 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 wait. I remember about a, a couple weeks ago. Ah! <laughs> kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Okay, no. Nah. Killer, you bastard! He got me again. As you see, guys, I cannot work with a sniper rifle in close range to save my life. Considering I didn't save my life, which explains a lot. Alright. What was I going on about earlier? I have a feeling I was about to say something important. 
Oh yeah, sniper rifle, uh, someone with a rifle, sniper rifle. Uh, they should always use at least one magazine, maybe two. There we go. Maybe two magazines. Main, it's okay. It's mainly one magazine you would use to. What the hell is guy doing? You mainly use one magazine. After that, you will move off while reloading. That allows you to at least use some cover on the way, so that people be watching your location, waiting for your your head to pop up again. But you're not going to because you're relocating, relo uh, reloading, and once you're in that new location. Once you're in that new location, everyone will be more focused on that one spot that you were before, which gives you the advantage to take them out. It also allows you to sneak up behind, especially if you have some enemy, some teammates up top there providing cover fire or distraction fire. Let's go in with a pistol. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, dude, come on, knife! Oh, okay. No, that's fine. I guess my teammates did kind of get in the wall. Oh, shit! <laughs> I almost killed myself. <laughs> Alright. Whoa, okay, shotgunner. Alright, I'm um, sorry, guys. I have to switch to rifleman, which means I'm going to have to work a little bit more towards the front. We have a medic covering us. Is, is that a medic with a sniper rifle? Alright, so, um... Okay. Sure. Alright, I think you require some ammo. Get get back here. Okay, I can't let a teammate go into war without ammo. I must at least give you ammo, then I can die. Okay. No. <laughs> Alright, if I can... The way I see it is, if I can help my teammates before I die, that's a good death. Or if I can somehow take the bullet for a teammate, that's also a good death to me. So yeah. Okay, or not, or not. These guys are awesome. I love these players. All right, that's that sounded very weird, but what I mean is, what the, what the, what, what, you know, whatever. I mean, these uh, guys are awesome because uh, whenever one of us needs help, they're immediately like, oh, okay, let me just jump down, help, okay. All right, that's our snipers on it, Zach. Okay, no, snipers are mainly watching that top area over there. Which makes sense because they're suppressing the other snipers, which allows us to get a little bit closer considering they can't kill us from long range. But it doesn't exactly help us because we ha should have, and I got 7 for 9. We should usually have a sniper that focuses, it's usually one or two snipers that focus, where am I? I know I've been talking a lot and stopping and talking and stopping, yeah I know, and stuttering quite a bit. I'm sorry about that, I do apologise. I'm just trying to say that uh, you would usually have two snipers suppressing the other snipers and allowing us to get further because those sni enemy snipers can't pin us out or kill us while we're on our way to enemy base. Which that does help us a hell of a lot. But as I said, you do need one or two on that. But then you still need at least uh, two, three or four snipers pushing back um, the, tr the troops on the ground, which allows us to still get further. And it also allows it to thin the herd. So if one of us, if let's say half the team gets killed, uh, we can still work with that because, yeah. All right. So I think that's about it for this episode. Um, I hope you guys uh, enjoyed. And I'm sorry that I try to honor, but, you know, uh, mumble on and stuff like that. I know. Just like that guy, just, just like that anime guy, Deku from My Hero Academy. We mumble on it quite a bit. Yeah. Anyway, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. A lot of my strategies are stupid. I know that. Screw you guys. And yeah, I guess that's about it. So first episode, Team Deathmatch. Awesome. See you guys next time.